hello guys you're welcome back to my youtube channel and if you're seeing this face for the very first time i just want to say you're welcome in this channel we learn we have fun and we educate okay so if you want to grow with me if you want to get more tips on how to grow your youtube channel how to monetize your, your facebook how to monetize your youtube channel just feel free to hit the subscribe button turn on the bell notification so you get more updates when i come up with new updates all right so without wasting much of your time in this video i'm going to share the tips which i use to get my adsense pin yes my youtube adsense pin within three weeks which is 21 days so i um, just stay relax get a pen and a jotter and jot things because in this video you're going to learn a lot the secret behind youtube adsense pin all right okay before i proceed let me say this there are a lot of youtubers that have uh, applied for this pin for over six to seven months some people over a year and they were unable to get the pin because of the lack the, the the little knowledge the little updates okay not everybody will tell you this but i decided to make this video because if you you don't know this you can after eating your monetization after eating the criteria you find it very difficult to get this pin you can work the whole year you can work the whole year just looking for this pin yeah okay and some things you need to avoid while applying for AdSense. I told you to get a book and a paper. This one is very important to make sure you write it down. When you're setting your account, make sure you don't put your account as a business account. Make sure you put it as an individual account. I repeat, don't use a business account because if you use a business account for your channel, they will ask you for documents that even in the next two years, you won't be able to produce it. So whatever you're doing online, even though you're doing Facebook monetization, any monetization you're applying for, make sure you use an individual account, okay? And the document that you'll be using is a valid ID card is for international passport or your driver's license. For me, I use my NIN. You cannot use the slip, the NIN slip. So I did a, a plastic ID card with my NIN. I went to the cyber cafe and I printed my NIN and I, uh, I turned it into a plastic form. So I snapped and they received it and uh, it was approved. And one other thing before I go into the main setting in the video. Okay, one other thing is if you apply for Google AdSense pin, you, I know even when I was applying, I was told to use a post office address, but I forgot I used my uh, my personal address. But there's nothing wrong if you use your personal address. But if you make a mistake and use your personal address, what you have to do after using your personal address, the next day, make sure you go to the nearest post office that is closer to you. So when I use my personal address, the next day, I went to two post office that is closer to me you know what i did I, I submitted my phone number because this adsense pin doesn't come with phone number it only comes with your address so when google brings your your pin they'll just take it to the post office so there is no number for the post office to call you so it will be there it will be, it will be dormant for over it will be there for more than six month okay so what i did i went to the post office closer to me and i submitted my phone numbers so immediately the pin arrived they checked the name that i submitted and they and they called say is this your number and i said yes why why was it possible for me because i already did some settings in my phone okay without wasting much of your time let's dive in into the video so you can know some settings you need to put in place before applying for this pin all right let's go in all right guys so when you get to your settings when you get to your youtube studio you head over to your settings when you head over to your settings the channel the gen yeah this place you're seeing general you put your currency in usd because if you put it in any other currency you won't be able to get paid okay so you put it in usd and you move over to your channel 
your channel, you put your country of residence to be Nigeria, and uh, your keywords, you can you can put in some keywords that are related to your niche. Okay, advanced settings. When you move over to advanced settings, you make sure that you there's one particular thing. You make sure you you link a Google AdSense account to your YouTube channel. Link your YouTube Google your YouTube channel to a Google AdSense account to enable you end from ad. You make sure you link it. Mine is already linked. Okay, so you link it. You link it to your account. After linking it, the next thing you do, you go to feature eligibilities. In feature eligibilities, you make sure you enable everything. You enable everything right here, okay? Enable everything. After doing that, you head over to permission. Permission is if you want to assign someone as a manager, you want to assign someone as an editor in your channel. If you do that, you move over to permission and agreement. You make sure you agree to every terms and condition here, okay? So after making those settings in your YouTube studio, you head over to your YouTube Google AdSense. There's a difference between a YouTube Google AdSense and a Google AdSense. Google AdSense is mainly for blogs while youtube google assistance is mainly for youtube all right so you move down to your account you're going to verify your account information you're going to verify your payment settings and before you verify your, your payment settings you're going to verify your identity settings first okay so you move you move down to verification check it's loading in verification check if you not if you notice my identity verification is completed and my address verification is completed what you need for identity verification you need a valid id card either your voters card or your nin or international passport while your address verification you need the address that is written in your verified document either your nin or your international passport okay so after doing this after submitting this document youtube will send you a pin that will take three weeks to deliver to your address okay it will take three weeks before it will be delivered to your address that is all for this video okay all right guys i have come to the end of the video please if you find this video educating and interesting please don't forget to like and smash that share button subscribe to this channel so you can get more enlightening tips on how to grow your channel okay please don't forget to like share and subscribe i love you guys peace out